This video will show you how to upload work for your class to do. So if you are in your um, classroom homepage and you click on the classwork tab at the top, this is where you can assign um, your work for them to do. If you click on the create button, it's going to ask you what type of post you want to make. I want to make an assignment for them to do. I'm going to click on assignment. And then I have to create a title. So if I want my students to complete the CNN 10 um, video and hyperdoc, that will be my title. If I want to put the instructions in, watch the video and the hyperdoc. When I click on add, I have a choice of what I want to add. Either I can add something from my Google Drive if it has previously been created. I can link it to a website. I can upload a file or I can insert a YouTube video. So since I want them to watch a video, I'm going to click on YouTube and you can either search for it or if you already have the URL for the YouTube video, you can paste it there. And I'm going to search for CNN 10. And I want to find today's video, which is up here at the top. So I'm going to click on that with the blue box around it and click add. That's going to put it into where my students can just click and watch the video. When I click on the create button, um, if I don't have anything that I have already created and can add from my Google Drive here, I'm going to come over to create and then I can create docs, slides, sheets, drawings, forms, any of that. But I want to create a doc and that's going to create a doc here. It's also going to open it up here. So if I, I need to title this document CNN 10, we'll say first day March 19th and this is where I want my students to do their work if I want to give them questions to ask list the top three stories and them. and then I can make um this that way if I wanted to do it a different way I could if I wanted to create boxes I could any way like this so now this is their spot that they're going to come and do their work if I go back to the classwork it's going to give you an option here where it says students can view the file which means they can only look at it students can edit the file which means that everybody can go in and edit it which um, if you are doing this for just a group of students, that might be better. But if you want everybody to do an individual assignment, then you're going to make a copy for each student. When you make a copy for each student, it's going to come up with their name here. It will say Lauren Houchins up here and then CNN 10 Thursday, March 19th. That way, this is the only thing that I have access to. And everybody else in your class will have access to their own individual one. You can, um, if you want to just do for certain students, you can. And once you have your students in here, you can pick and choose who gets this assignment. You can also put in a due date if you don't have to, but if you want this to be due, whatever, and a topic if you wanted to create a topic. Also, when you're creating assignments, you have the option to um, schedule assignments. So if you want to schedule an assignment, so you want to go ahead and get the work put up and then Google does the work and posts it for you, you can do that. If you want to wait to schedule this assignment until tomorrow at a certain time, you can do that and just hit schedule and it will take care of it on its own. However, if you want to post it immediately, just go ahead and click assign. And then it will assign that work for you. And then it comes up here. Once students are in here, you'll see how many have been assigned and how many students have turned in their work.